What's going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome back to some more Slime Rancher. So, uh, what's going on in the Slime Rancher world? Well, we have an update actually in pending on the 18th of June, I believe it is. So, we are playing some Slime Rancher. We're getting things ready for that update. That way, as soon as it comes out, I can show you exactly all the excitement and what's going on with that. So, uh, we have been streaming Ash or er, Ashner. We've been streaming Slime Rancher. Over on twitch.tv slash d1 gaming. If you guys want to check it out, you go right ahead. Link down below. So, pretty much in the last actual episode that I made of this, we had these guys, and that was pretty much it. Well, since then, um, actually, we already unlocked this area. But since then, we have unlocked this area right here, which is the grotto. We've unlocked the grotto, and as you can see, we have quantum slimes in here. We have quantum tangle slimes. And before I had them all as quantum slimes with, with no no uh, Largo variant, which means that they're mixed with another one, they're bigger. But uh, we mixed with Tangle slimes because, well, we thought it was a good idea on stream. Anyways, it's kind of not, it's kind of hard to collect the um, the little plorts. It's kind of hard to collect those. So um, we did that. We unlocked the science area. That's right. We got some slime science going on. It's, uh, it's a pretty good time. These guys need to calm down. Cool it. And the reason we have these over here is because for some of the slime science stuff, we need tabbies, we need rocks. So these are tabby rock uh, slimes. And these are phosphor pink slimes because you always need pink plorts for like literally everything. And you need some phosphor. So we mix those guys. And then back here, we have a little ball pit of more pink slimes in case we need to get any even more. Um, but yes, so what we're going to work on today is I would like to get a teleporter i want a teleporter i need some hexacomb and i need some strange diamond and the reason i want that specifically the first one that i'm going to build is because we also unlocked the ancient ruins and we unlocked the glass desert now to get to the glass desert we have to go all the way from here all the way up around all the way up here to this portal which will put us out here and then all the way back down over here um so that's a very long way to go to go to the glass desert if you want to go there frequently uh so that's that's why i want the teleporter i want to make one final trip there and hopefully get absolutely everything done but if you guys enjoy the video don't forget to leave a like if you're new here don't forget to subscribe as well for some more um yeah, I made prickly pears because I thought I I needed them for something and then I don't need them anymore. So I have a lot of that left over. Also, we're kind of getting to the point where I'm making more plorts than I can deal with because we're getting hundreds of all of them. So I've been trying to put them into the the uh, the science machine because that's where I have things have to be stored in order to make the sciences and whatnot. So I've been trying to do that, but I've also been trying to sell some. And we've been doing some 7Z rewards, all that fun stuff. But first, we're going to start with checking our uh, our deals. Checking the deals. Uh, okay, that, was, that wasn't that great. <laughs> that was not that great. Do you have anything for me? No, you don't. And that one's gone too. Okay. So I'm going to go drop these back off into the science machine. And then we're going to head over. I have some more machines up. I need some strange diamond. I need, I need a strange diamond. That's like the one thing I need. So... I have some more machines up. Actually, you can see them right here on the map. We have some over here in the Indigo Quarry. I think that's the area. And we have some over here in the forest area. I can't remember the names. So we have these guys. The apiaries are going to give me the uh, the hexacomb, hopefully. And then hopefully the drills will give us the strange diamond. But, uh, but yeah, so let me go drop this stuff off. And we'll head over there and we'll check some machines. All right, let's see what we got in here. Strange diamond, please, would be nice. Not gonna happen. How about you? No strange diamond, darn it. Um, now, I don't wanna do with these guys because I don't have room for them, unfortunately. So, kind of focusing on the drills. Do I have another drill? I have one over here. Um, I guess we could go, let's go check out that one real quick too. We're not. We're not super far, but th this is why there's so many different colored teleporters. If you guys didn't realize, um, there's like, there's a pink, a blue, a, I think there's a green one. There's a butterscotch one. There's, I think like a silver or gray one. There's a ton of teleporters and that's because that way you can have a teleporter to each area. So you don't have to run everywhere you go. It's fantastic. So, um, hopefully we can get some of those unlocked, but right now we're focused on the one 
and the one for the the uh the glass desert because that is like a very long ways away and it's always a pain to run there all right drill strange diamond for me no no strange diamond darn it <laughs> i was hoping all right well i guess maybe maybe on the next one um and then i have apiaries over here and i need all the hex to come from those but i want to take these back i have one open slot and one open inventory slot but that's just really not gonna be enough uh i see a golden slime over here let's go ahead and start pegging this guy no we got one are you kidding me are you kidding me we got a single one out of this guy oh my goodness i was like oh we got all kinds of food <laughs> i was so excited well oh well what can you do what can you do oh also i guess i can show you this guy we got the docks unlocked as well and down here we have some tangle uh some tangle mosaics these guys are the money makers these are the ones that make me probably the most money because all you need, if you mix these two silver parsnips, you can feed three pens of them. And you are escaping. How are you escaping so easily? No. Um, do we not have an air net on this one? Oh, we don't have an air net. What am I doing? I was like, how, wait, how did one not get out then? That's kind of crazy. Anyways, continuing on. Hey, there we go. New blueprint available. Refinery link allows you to remotely deposit resources in to the refinery oh my gosh okay so the market link this one allows you to place um you can place a, a market link anywhere you want and it'll allow you to sell stuff without having to go all the way to the market every time but the refinery link allows you to put stuff in the refinery which is great because uh we need royal jelly i'll probably get that at the out of the apiaries um these two are fantastic. The market link is great because we can place that over by the tangle, the mosaic tangles that I have down on the other side. So I don't have to go to the market. The refinery is great because I can place it out in the front where I have all the other guys making their refinery stuff. So I don't have to run all the way back here. That's the plan anyways. So uh, these guys, we can throw these in here, no problemo. But then we don't have to run around trying to collect all that fun stuff either. Like you're trying to collect it and then run back and then run forward. And you know what? You know what I mean? It's just, it's just, uh, it's just nice to not have to do that. All right, let's check these apiaries out. Oh, we got some royal jelly. I didn't get any hexacomb though. Oh no. I thought we were going to get hexacomb for sure. Okay, we got one. Um, I can't remember how many I need. I got one. That's not enough. And I need, I need better apiaries. My goodness. Those apiaries do not last very long. Uh, but we got, I mean, we got royal jelly. That's pretty handy. So I, I guess that's, I mean, it's not terrible, but um, this is actually the only place you can even get royal jelly from. So if you need a royal jelly, this is where you have to go to get it. Right here. This place. It's it's marvelous. Well, unfortunately, we didn't get what we need, needed exactly. But, I mean, we're one step closer, right? We need two more hexacomb and one strange diamond. Luckily, we do have the advanced apiary now. So let's go ahead and make a one, two, let's make three of those guys. Uh, we're probably going to need some more drills and uh, some more pumps as well. We kind of need all of that. Luckily, these guys are right here. So I can go ahead and just throw these right onto the science machine and we'll be good to go. All right. So we are good. We have some more machinery we can go ahead and place out. Um, are you guys good on food right now? You're way good. And you're way good. Okay. Well, I'm not even gonna worry about that. Actually, you know what? We are running a little bit low on pink, on pink ports. So I might just grab this food and throw it in with the, the uh, those guys over there. Give us a little boost in pink port plower, plower, pink port power. Yeah, it's kind of a mouthful. Oh, finally. So I came by these guys and the port collectors were completely full. So I had to go through and I had to empty them all out. I just sold it because I was like, you know what? We have enough in the storage for the science anyways. So I sold it all. It took, well, I actually it took about all day on in game, but we now have 40,000 new bucks. I think they're called and still no more, uh, still nothing else. Cool. So what we're going to do, um, actually, you know what? We are going to go place our apiaries down, place drills down, place all that fun stuff down. And then we're gonna come back. We're gonna sleep for the night and then go back because when you sleep, it actually speeds up the, uh, the game and it speeds up the time left on the drills and collectors. So. We're gonna run all the way back over there, do that again, set them up, hopefully get the stuff we <laughs> hopefully get the stuff we need, and then hopefully get a teleport built. Sweet, we made it back. Okay, let's place down these apiaries, advanced apiary, 
fantastic and because we need the royal jelly anyways this is the only place you can really get the royal jelly so uh apiary install i want to do uh, some more we have one there i need more technology spots more technology spots hey there's a slime toy cool uh apiary and then we'll do one over here just so we can come over here and collect all of them at the same time and then i think for the pumps and the other things i don't think the chances increase by being in an area like this or the strange diamond i think it's just kind of like a an, an rng kind of thing so i'm gonna place those place those a little bit closer so i don't have to run all the way back here to get them every single time oh dear i'm out of stamina all right we're gonna throw drills here because i have a teleport that takes me pretty close to here uh install that one i guess we'll throw a pump in here too why not advanced pump fantastic do i have room for another one one there one there is there any over here uh, oh yeah, there is. Okay, cool. And pump. Perfect. All right. So all the technologies are placed. Fantastic. And like I said, we have a teleport. Oh my gosh. Right in here. That will hopefully get us our strange diamond fairly quickly. Probably not, but maybe. <laughs> hopefully. All right, apiaries. Be good to me. Okay, we got one hexacomb. Uh, no royal jelly. That's fine. Oh, we got the other one. Okay, good. Ooh, we got the hexacomb. So we are literally just waiting on a, on a, uh, a strange diamond. Hmm. Um. You know what? Let's check it. Strange diamond? No. Uh, we'll just leave it there. <laughs> I can't really bring it back anyways. So let's go ahead and grab all of this. No more royal jelly though. Interesting. I was expecting at least one of these to have... Oh, there's one. Okay, that was, a, that was a good one. Perfect. So I know we need the Royal Jelly for future stuff anyways. And I'm just gonna have to leave it there. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, I wish we had a teleport here too. That'd be nice if we could just like, boop, right back. I think I used to, used to in my other series. I actually had a teleport, I think like right here somewhere. It was fantastic. All right, those are deposited, ready to go. Let's go check on our drills in the Indigo Quarry and see if we can't get a strange diamond out of those. That is the last thing that we're gonna need. I cannot wait to make a teleport, even though I do have to make the trek the very first time. It's gonna be uh, actually, yeah, yeah, the first time we have to we have to run all the way to where we want to go. But um, once we get there, we won't have to run back because we'll have a teleport. Strange diamond. <gasps> yes. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I'm so happy. Um, where's the other ones at? put one up there no you hey did i only put two down one two i guess i only put two down did i put any over here Oop. all right i guess i only put those two down oh we have the diamond we have the diamond yeah one there one there and then i put drill okay all right that's fine that is completely okay now we can make ourselves our very own teleporter oh marvelous days the beginning of something great and now we can transport back and forth, get the stuff we need a little bit easier. We are going to need more strange diamonds if we want to make more teleports. But for the most part, the strange diamond, I think, is the hardest thing to get. It is. It's the, hard, it's the hardest thing to get, hands down. But we have everything we need. This is exciting. Super exciting. All right. You, warp tech, pink teleporter. Okay, I need 25 pink ports. Easy enough. Uh, we can make a blue one. We can make a blue teleporter. Ooh. Um, I guess we'll just make the blue one. Why not? Might as well. But yeah, we have a butterscotch teleport already too. Need silky sand for that. But uh, fabricate. Yes. Yes. Okay. So let's go ahead and put the first link down. Now, where do I want to go? There's a lot of there's a lot of slots right here, and I think this is normally where I put my teleports. Because you got like one, two, three, four. Five, six, all in one area, and it's super easy. So let's go ahead and put warp tech, this one, install. Boom. There's one. Now we have to make it all the way to the glass desert. Let's do it. To the glass desert we go. Oh, this is gonna be the final time making that trip. Oh, it takes so long. It takes so long to make it there. You have to go around and over and under and do a whole bunch of stuff. It's just a pain getting over here. Now, I know exactly where we're going to build our other portal. Um, this area, I haven't really done anything with yet. 
there's some like magical springs and stuff that like that that we have to do uh so we'll do that eventually also in case you guys were curious they definitely changed the gilded ginger um i don't know if you guys were playing right when the gilded ginger first came out but it before it would only spawn one a day one single one a day and there was no way to find it other than by looking you had to go to the areas you had to just go look around well now there's a sound that plays so when you're close to one you can hear like a ringing it kind of sounds like a lucky slime and there's more than one a day because i found two while we were streaming i found two in a matter of a matter of seconds from each other i walked past one got it kept walking found another one immediately it was fantastic it was great so uh yes be on the lookout for that if you're looking for there we go we did it we absolutely did it oh my gosh this is momentous day momentous day <laughs> um but yeah so if you're looking for a gilded ginger just listen around and you'll probably find one fairly easy because they like they make a ringing sound that doesn't it the only thing i can compare it to is a lucky slime because i thought it was a lucky slime at first um and it's not that sound of the falling deals but uh yeah it's it's very i wonder like i almost feel like they're they're actually easy to find now you can just run around and listen for sound let's go see if we can find one real quick well i'm not finding any but that's okay because i'm not really in the market for them anyways i figured i would just take a quick run around see if i could hear anything uh not hearing anything so i don't think there i don't think there's one out and there's also like a certain time if i remember correctly that you could find them and i believe we are too late in the day i think they already like fell out and kind of like started rotting away uh you know how they do because they have a really really like short life on the ground like they don't last very long so <laughs> anyways let's go ahead let's use our new fancy teleport and let's head back <gasps> oh this is wonderful i just want to do this because we can go so far oh it's so great it is so very great and then we have two more teleports that we can still make uh with very little effort i think we're actually gonna need more hex comb. so uh the ap areas will be having to visit those and i think that's probably the next area i'm going to build another teleport is to the area where i have the ap areas because that was kind of a pain to run to too not as bad but still you know a teleport in each each main area is always a good thing Alrighty, what a beautiful morning it is and we're gonna do one last final check of our drills see if we can get another strange uh, strange diamond will it happen probably not but if we get lucky maybe we will and i would still need some apiary stuff if i'm not mistaken but we can at least check for the strange diamond because that is again i think the hardest thing to get i think it should be it's a strange diamond it's a diamond it should be worth a lot Eh. Uh, okay no strange diamond there uh, no strange diamond here either uh, do we have one more i thought i had more than two i had one there one two did i not put out any more drills i thought i put out a bunch of drills i must i must be completely mistaken i am i'm completely mistaken i definitely thought we had more drills than that we have a lot of uh or uh yeah we have a lot of drills we don't have a lot of pumps or we have a lot of pumps not a lot of drills interesting i thought i put out more than that oh well anyways live and learn but that is actually going to end this episode guys hopefully you enjoyed if you did don't forget to leave a like if you're new here don't forget to subscribe as well helps out the channel a lot and as always if you guys are interested we do stream over on twitch three times a week and uh yeah we've, we've been playing slime rancher over there lately so if you enjoy this you want to catch some a live action slime rancher definitely head on over but uh yes thank you guys so much for coming out appreciate the support and you guys have a fantastic week